Hi YouTube! And today I gonna show you how to culture in Fosoria. But before that, thank you for visiting our channel. And for more updates, please don't forget to subscribe. First, we need an empty 6 liter water container. And we have to cut the upper part of the 6 liter container. We are going to use the upper part as a cover. We need to cut the handle. And now we are ready for the next step. We will be using an aged water. We have to remove the cover first. And we have to pour the water into the empty container. Now we are going to add the fish food pellets to the water. And we have to cover it. It's okay if you just leave it open. And now we are going to put this on a safe place. It should be direct sunlight the whole day. It would take 4 to 5 days for the infosoria to appear. Now all you need is a little patience. At first the bacteria will bloom and later the algae and next would be the infosoria. Infosoria can live for 2 months if properly maintained. This is my Infosoria culture. Here you will see Infosoria, Paramecium, and Daphnias. If you want to know how to maintain the culture of Infosoria, please visit and subscribe to our YouTube channel, Palawan Ornamental Fish Hub. Here is another culture of my Infosoria. As you can see, there is banana peel and dry leaves. If you have any question or suggestion, you may visit our Facebook page, Palawan Ornamental Fish Hub. Here you will see small moving creatures and those are daphnias, another kind of daphnias, smaller than daphnia monea.
excellent food for the beta fry. This is my paramecium culture. Paramecium culture can live into this little jar forever if they are properly maintained. For more updates, subscribe to our YouTube channel, Palawan Ornamental Fish Hub. Thank you for watching and see you next time.